Hey, what's up guys? Stealthpig here from Team Vesper. Um, this is a glitch on Venus to get back into the strike room of the echo chamber. Normally in this patrol, you cannot get there. And um, it's kind of sad, so we figured out a way to get inside and uh, to help you to enjoy. I'm joined here with War. Hey, what's up guys? And basically, we're just going to be taking a look at this. It is at the far edge of the map. Like, it's pretty far away, but it's totally worth it because you can explore the whole strike room, find little secrets and all that. So make sure you stay for the whole video. Okay, so here we are spawning up on the patrol spawn. And we're going to go on our sparrows and take a right this way. Um, just I'm going to speed this up a little bit so you guys can watch where I'm going. But um, yeah, just follow the path that we're going there and we'll be there shortly. Alright, so here we are at the endless steps, guys. Um, you're gonna head over this way to where the um, Cyclops normally are in the strike. And if I can show you guys right over here, as you can see, this door is completely boarded off. There's no way you're able to get in. But we actually did find a way to get in. So, um,. We're gonna pop a synth here. We are on our hunters with a nice agility build. Uh, Night Stalkers with Bones of Ao. Got this sword. Nothing else really matters. So we're gonna jump into it. And yeah. Okay, so basically me and Wartang kind of found this together. We kind of helped each other out. Um, figuring out into this boss room. So big thanks to him. And uh, let's get it started. So we're gonna jump over to the edges of these rocks over here. And then we're gonna jump up here. From here, there's a barrier right there, so we're going to have to avoid that and jump around it, just around the back, and then land down here. There will still be a barrier to your right, right here as you can see, so don't worry about that. Okay, so from here to pass that barrier that I was just talking about, we're going to jump up here and crouch through, so you can kind of squeeze through it and all, and then we jump onto this big rock. from here you can see it from right here we're gonna be landing right down there but when we go up it's gonna vanish so you gotta kind of be careful and just kind of estimate just like that from here you're just gonna jump around and land on this corner right here from here you're gonna jump all the way down to right here kind of go on the edge right here can see just like that and then this is kind of hard because there's a death barrier right below us so you got to be really careful about that and kind of avoid it get here from here we go up to the stairs and this is where it gets a lot more easy oh, <laughs> rest and from here you can see that there is that ledge over there the entrance is actually right up there that we I was talking about so what we're gonna do is kind of do another blind thing I'm gonna see if I can see it one more time right here so that's what we're aiming for. We're gonna jump up here and aim for that exact thing. There's a barrier to the left a little bit, so you kinda wanna avoid that and kinda hug the right a little more. And then this is where you gotta be really careful. You just gotta jump on the edge. You don't wanna walk any more forwards from here. You gotta be really careful not to walk forwards because then you're gonna be stuck outside the map and then you're gonna hit the checkpoint. <laughs> yeah. Alright, from here, jump right over to this ledge. 
and then this is where you got to be really really precise and you got to jump under this ledge and hit the um, checkpoint at the top of the ceiling under jump right on down hit it just like that and as you can see we just hit the checkpoint and since we didn't land on anything we're gonna spawn up inside the echo chamber after we die just like that and see we are in, in the strike room and if we go back to the entrance door it will be closed and we'll be on the other side of it which is pretty cool all right so yeah as you can see endless steps we just hit the other checkpoint but we are on the other side of it now and um yeah we just figured this all out ourselves it's pretty cool um i always used to do this um but i never figured out a way to get in so another thanks to war for helping this helping me out gonna go back into the strike room and i'm gonna talk about some stuff so you can explore around here there's i don't know how high these hair barriers go probably climb up there if you want it really doesn't matter you can go wherever you want in the strike room there is a little barrier a hype area and a death barrier but um normally in the strike room you would um like jump down there and you would land on something but there is nothing to land on and the death barrier is pretty far down too bad you can't get down there but it's still pretty cool as you can see war he's trying to get on some of the pegs down here you can actually jump on the spinning um thing you don't move with it it's kind of weird how it works it's like a treadmill i guess but um i don't know it's, it's pretty cool to just stand in and look down there because we've never gotten so close to um like we've never got to explore it here because we're always fighting the boss and stuff so it's kind of fun to just take a break and kind of look around <laughs> nice all right so we just found a dead ghost in here um not sure if we should pick it up i think we like so there was a, a whole scam in year one about how um the um lord's watch or whatever whatever it was called i don't know what i, I forgot what it's called the like king's king something i don't know it was in the patrol and it was boarded off and people were glitching inside there and getting inside and there was two ghosts and supposedly if you did pick up the ghosts um you get reported to bungie and you get banned but i'm pretty sure yeah i'm pretty sure it's fake i'm gonna pick it up it's right up here guys oh <laughs> I, I don't really care um it's totally a scam like this is all the barriers and everything are here just like the normal strike room so i'm pretty sure they just put this in patrol and then they added the enemies inside of it so everything kind of stays so i don't really trust that theory but if you guys don't want to do it just do it at your own risk really doesn't matter there is a lot more to uh discover and me and war have found quite a few things but um i guess we'll let the exploration I'll let, we'll let you do the exploration for yourself but um yeah so that's gonna end the video guys if you want to see more strike glitches or glitching into other rooms tell me what strike it is i'll do my best to find a way to get inside that room in patrol um i have found one on sabris Bay. i know people have made videos on it but i found another way to get inside that um i know a few other ones so just comment down below what you want to see next and yeah team vesper out Boom headshot! Boom headshot! Boom headshot!